going on, ladies and gentlemen? Dr. D-Dub here, and welcome back to Freedom Park. We have about a year left in this park, a little over a year, and I think that is enough time to do, hopefully, hopefully we have enough time, to do another trio of coasters. I realize these are water rides, not necessarily coasters, quite like uh, the Three Monkeys rides are, which are just insane, but I kind of want to do another trio and I'm thinking I want to do a wooden trio. And we technically have four wooden rides. Uh, the wooden side friction, wooden wooden twister, which is brand new, uh, and wooden crazy rodent. Um, I don't want to do the wooden crazy rodent because it just feels a whole lot different. And the wooden side friction, I'm really hesitant to do. Uh, because if you'll see down here, it says cheap and easy to build, but the track layout needs to be designed carefully, otherwise the cars can fly straight off the track. Which basically means I can't do anything too crazy with this one, and I kind of want to. So what I'm thinking of doing is doing the two on the outside, because again, they're going to be lined up in synchronized launch mode, or at least they'll look that way. Uh, the two on the outside, we're going to do the wooden roller coaster, and the one in the middle... We're gonna try the wooden twister roller coaster, which is basically a wooden coaster fused with a steel coaster as far as the track. Like you can see there, that's a steep decline with a twist in it, hence the name. Um, is there any, yeah, so bank curve, steep twist, banked helix. It, yeah, really it's just the steep twist. That's the only difference. Uh, so that's kind of cool. And it, and it looks pretty cool too. I like the, the car design. But anyway, let's go ahead and start with these. Um, I want to build the stations first, just like we did with the other one. And I'm pretty sure I already have the exact spot I want to start picked out. I had to come in and kind of figure out where all this would work. Um, but we're going to do something, something like that. And then we're going to run the back actually into this hillside. I think that could be kind of cool. Uh, so this is all going to have to get adjusted. Uh, yeah, we'll lower all these down. Uh, the reason I'm doing this here is because being the last coaster or last trio, I kind of want to use most of our available space. So we can start out going this direction, loop it back around, do some stuff in this area, maybe even swing it all the way over here. I, I don't quite know. I'm not sure we'll have the money for all that. Especially doing wood coasters at high elevations. They can get pretty expensive pretty quick. Um, but we're going to do max max station length on all these. Uh, and then we're going to start back out front here with a big lift. Uh, and I'm not sure how I want to build these. Um, with the, the Starbucks trio up there, we kind of did one at a time. Like we started doing a little bit of each and then we went off and to do one at a time. This, I I don't know. I'm at least going to do this first portion all together. Um, it, it's going to be interesting. So what I'm trying to do right here is, well, let me just get it up first on all three stations, and then I'll talk about what I'm trying to do. It'll make a little bit more sense. So then we're going to do the twister in the middle which looks, all intents and purposes, it looks the exact same uh, until we start getting track going. I'm pretty sure it looks the exact same. Yeah, it's just the paint job that's different. All right, so we did that and then flatten out there. That's two of them. And then we're going to do another wooden one. Oh my goodness, yeah, this is going to get ridiculously expensive. This might be a, uh, a coaster that we take years in game to build but you guys will just be seeing the finished product as i go because i might have to do a lot of waiting around for money because right now we've already spent about three grand and we don't have much to show for it so that might be an issue yeah we're already down to five grand um how much more money can we take out it's like three grand i think oh we haven't touched our loan yet okay so we might be able to, I don't know. Anyway, so I want these three to basically turn and then do a steep drop together. So I want them all to rotate as a group and then rotate again and then 
drop straight down. Or as close to straight as these rides can. But since we're doing a 180, this one on the inside is going to get there first. So what I have to do is turn it, drop it by two, and then basically do two S-bends. Actually, no, instead of doing two S-bends, we do that to bring it to the outside. And now that it's on the outside, so we did a tight turn here. And then we'll take it straight for a little bit, two, three, do a wide one. And then we should, assuming I did that properly, be able to start dropping here. Now I'm going to stop on that one for now and see if I can get the others lined up. So the one in the middle here, uh, we're going to do a wide turn. And this is just going to go straight. It'll go straight over these and then drop down by 2 to 25. And then starting here, do a normal one, go straight for one and drop there. This is looking really cool so far. And then our other one, I might not have planned this as good as I hoped. Uh, we'll go wide here. We're already out of money. Oh gosh, this is going to be expensive. Let's just max our loan. We're going to need it all. Um, okay, so this needs to get to the inside. Um, hold on. I think what I need to do here is actually lower this even more. So that was two. That's three. That's four. Then do this. And then come up. This might not work quite like I was planning. Uh, it might not look as clean at least. But if we get up to 25 there. Can we bank this turn? Yeah, so it's going to look a little different. But it should hopefully, hopefully work. Um, and then this, it's going to have to... Drop by two. And then hopefully we can come through here. Perfect. There we go. Okay. I'm glad that worked out. Had a little bit of trouble there in the middle, but we got it working. Okay. There's a part of me that wants to test all three of these just to see where they line up and then immediately close all of them. And I think that's going to happen. I'm just now realizing I screwed up my stations. Um, well, at least on the back side. Uh, dang, that means we have to get an entrance underground. Which is not ideal. Uh, what did I say? That needed to be three shorter. Two, three. That should be good, right? Because we'll have an entrance and exit on that back tile. And then two tiles to turn into the station. Okay. That's going to have to work. Um, we'll see if we can't get an entrance and exit on everything. So this is the white one. So that's on the outside here. We'll do these up front. And then the exit kind of back here. Sure. That was... I don't even know which one that was. Okay, so then this is the inside. Yeah, inside? Yes, okay. <laughs> we'll do a mirror image of that. There we go. And then I'm just doing this so I can test it and make sure I did all that properly. I think I did, but I don't want to get all the way to the end and realize I screwed up the very start because I need them to be in sync or I want them to be in sync from the very beginning. All right, which tile is this? So that's the middle and we go back one, two, three. So based on the middle, it's one, two, three, and it's the tile to the side of that. So that's again, one, two, three, it's this one. So hopefully if I just lower that a lot, 
that should work. Hey, it does. Cool. And then the exit we'll try to do on the opposite side. So right there. <laughs> Expensive fix, but you got to do what you got to do. And this is all just so I can test the ride, which is kind of ridiculous. We'd have to do this all eventually anyway, and I'll make that look better. Um, but all right. So we have all three of these. I need to make these just drastically different in paint just to from the start, just so I can see what I'm doing. We'll make one all white. We'll make one all black. Just so I can easily keep track of what's what. Alright, so white, black, and then we'll just do something bright. I guess wood color is fine. Yeah, those are all three very different colors. Okay, that works. Um, Alright, so let's, let's get these set to synchronize with each other and uh what happened yep i knew this was gonna happen that's what i get why did it get stuck here that's that's kind of weird uh anyway all right so we've got these all set to synchronize with each other and now oh just kidding Wow, never mind. I forgot you can do that on any ride you set as uh, a non-continuous circuit mode. So powered launch mode or inverse or... Yeah, inverse incline, reverse incline launch mode. There we go. It's been a while since I've done one of those. Uh, you can test them when they're not complete, but with these, you can't. So I'm going to hope that's right. So I did a small turn and a... Large turn. It's not quite the same, but it should be pretty close. And this one went down by four and then up by two. So we have a minus two elevation change. The black one in the middle here did two medium-sized turns and it dropped by two. And then the one on the outside did a large turn and a small turn and also dropped by two. So we should be correct in all of that. I hope. I really, really hope. And, oh man, we've already taken out all of our loan and we only have 10 grand. Whoo boy. Okay. Um, so we're going to just do a crazy drop here to start. <laughs> I think that could be really cool. And then we'll do an on-ride photo section on all of these. I always forget to do these. It's easy, easy money. I might as well. On-ride photo. This is really cool. I like doing these together. Um, we might not do that at some point based on how much money we have, but I'm going to try to build them as a as a whole as much as I can here. Um, I think it'd be cool if we do something similar to... Where is it? To this. Having a straight section where they all kind of... Try to see if there's any coasters inbound. Doesn't look like it. Uh, a straight section where they all just kind of go straight. They don't shift too much, but they all just kind of weave. Like, they're a tangled mess, but it's a three-wide tangled mess. I think it looks really cool. We might try to incorporate that somewhere in here. I don't know if we'll have the space or the ability or... I, I really don't know. Uh, but we dropped this from 25... So let's take this up a little bit to 21. And then... Ooh, let's start doing some turns, I guess. This is where they might get a little bit off from each other. But I think it'll still be really cool. So I'm doing these in small, small sections here. Um... But I'm going to basically run them next to each other for, like, all of this. Um, so we'll do this kind of in chunks. So that's going to be our, our chunk for that. <laughs> and then basically all we have to do is follow that. And assuming I did it correctly, it should line up pretty well. I hope. If it doesn't, well, that's going to be unfortunate. 
And we're going to have one section where we break these off from each other and have them do their own thing. Why did that not line up? Do I need to go straight more? Ah, that's what I did. Okay, that looks way better. I knew something looked off there. Um, but yeah, we are going to have one section of this where they break off and do their own thing. Because I want the uh, twister or the twisted wooden coaster that we're working with right now, the black one, to be able to do some twisted stuff. And if we're doing these in unison here, or having them run alongside each other, it's not going to work out. So, all right, let me just make sure I'm doing this right. So they are, they should all be aligned coming down here. Um, and so this one does one turn, another turn, and this turn. Okay, so the... The white one will be slightly ahead when we get to this turn. Okay. And the only way to rectify that is to do another... I don't know. <laughs> I, I'm i trying to make them synchronized. They're going to get off at some point. I just know it. So, But we'll do our best. All right. So that goes straight for one, then turns. There we go. Oh, this, this is looking really cool. I hope you guys agree. I love doing wooden coasters, period. But doing three of them, oh man, it just makes it that much better. I like how we're kind of above the trees. We really haven't had to get rid of many, if any, trees so far, which has been really nice. All right, we turn that and we drop it. And we are hurting so bad for money right now. We spent six grand on that chunk right there. And I'm sure we actually spent more than that because we've been earning money this entire time. Oh, boy. I think part of my issue with money in this park is the fact that we don't have that many small rides. We have, what, six? And people aren't even riding some of them. Did someone say something about not paying that much? Maybe? No, people are still riding it. Uh, no one is on these. That's not good. We'll drop these all to a dollar. Hopefully that'll help. Sorry for taking this intermission here. I think that money is going to be a huge factor in making these coasters what they can truly be. And if I don't have the money to do that, then they're going to suffer. We'll drop this to a dollar as well, or 90 cents, since I overshot it and I don't want to bother fixing it drop those. Is anyone riding our, our three monkeys? Hear no evil, see no evil, speak no evil. Uh, where's the stations for those? Right here? Yeah, people are still riding those. That's not an issue at all. Okay. Let's assume we're making money from everything and continue this coaster. Um, okay, so the white one, I said, is ahead by one turn. So as of right now, everything's either doing the outside turn, the middle turn, or the inner turn, and they need to have an equal number of all of those to align properly, eventually, at, or by the time they get to the end, at least. So, we've got an inside, outside, outside, inside. Oh, I forgot this counts as two turns. So yeah, that they are lined up. I was really confused there. Okay, so then this one has an outside, inside, inside, outside and then a middle 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 which all averages out to four middle turns each i hope that makes sense to you guys i'm sure i'm not needing to explain this as heavily as i am but <laughs> oh well all right so what where are we at right now 20 and we started at 25 okay so we can easily make a turn here um Yeah. Ooh, what would doing... Hold on. I'm getting ideas. They're not workable ideas, apparently. But they're ideas. Okay, so if we actually make this go straight for two, and then do a... One of these. And then this one will go straight for one, and then do one of these. And this one won't go straight at all. 
it'll just go straight into it. Actually, no, it needs to go. No, it doesn't. It just needs to. Yeah, I was right. Okay, now we have them lined up. Oh, this looks cool. Look at that. That just looks awesome. All right. We're at 20. We're actually not going super fast right now. Um, so let's do... Is it the tree in the way or the land? It's probably going to be the land. Yeah, it's going to be the land. Uh, so if we do a little something here, nothing too crazy, but I need to get back up here because we need to do another turn and I don't want to be doing these turns too aggressively. All right, that's at 18. There we go. All right, this one we'll try to... Nope, wrong one. Oh my goodness. Why can't I click on it? There we go. <laughs> oh, that's the struggle. All right, these trees are going to be very much in the way. All right, so we go down to ground level, I believe, and then up. There we go. Okay, and then this one's going to have to go... Oh, yeah. Okay, so this is where they're making up. So this this one... Actually, I don't know. We're just going to assume that they're all in line still. <laughs> they're probably not, but it'll be all right. Oh, my goodness. Why can't I... That is so strange. I was clicking on it. It wasn't giving me the building tool, but it was already there. I, I don't know. Okay. I don't like the silence, guys. If it's not silent as you're listening to this, it's probably because I didn't like it so much that I added some music in the background. But if it is silent, then yeah, it's, it's, it's awkward. <laughs> okay. And then this one will have to go straight for two to line up yeah okay so this is the part where I think we should split off a little bit we're already or actually what if we do hold on I got another potentially cool looking idea okay so that's at 18 to 15 so that should Wooden reverse roller coaster? What is that? It sounds cool, whatever it is. Okay, I don't know what I'm doing here exactly. But that should be somewhat cool. Um, so if we do... We're basically going to do the same thing on all these. But since they don't come out at the exact same position... They're going to be staggered by one. So this will be lagging behind everything we did by one. And normally this wouldn't look that great. But having three of them, it'll look sort of like a wave effect, which I think could be really cool. Uh, did we add a tile there? No, okay. So we just get to go straight into it after getting rid of some trees, which is per usual. All right, yeah, so this is gonna look, I think, really cool. I'll show it uh, from the other angle here in a sec. I think it'll look even better from that angle. Uh, but this goes down to 13 and then up. Or maybe we just keep them all at 13 and flatten out here. I don't, I don't quite know. <laughs> Hold on, why does that look like it's lower? It looks like it's lower. That's because it's lower. All right, I went down one further on these. So this will need to flatten out at 13. There we go. Okay. Oh, this is getting expensive. <laughs> I don't even know if we're going to be able to finish this coaster in this episode, guys. I'm wanting this to be pretty massive. And so far... Actually, it's not that far off. I... I don't know if I want to end up bringing it all the way over here, because then getting back, it's just going to be... It's going to be difficult. I, I don't know, guys. I'm not sure what my plan is yet. I also am not sure on what I want to name this yet, so if you guys have any suggestions 
as far as a wooden trio goes, I was thinking something along the lines of, you know, that that uh, tongue twister. How much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? Something like that. There's there's something there. I'm just not seeing it quite yet. Uh, but any wooden related names, if you guys have any, please let me know in the comments below. Because I'm kind of struggling for a name for this this beast. This just looks so cool right now. Uh, but I want to do a little bit more of this, where they, they don't just run all alongside each other. I think we're kind of done with that for now. Um, so this, let's take this one. Let's go ahead and split these off now. I think we've, yeah, we've run alongside each other enough. So at this point, they're just going to kind of run and do their own thing. And I'm going to try to make them do an equal amount of their own thing so that they end up somewhat close together at the end um but if they're not exactly in line that's okay uh and i also kind of want to do oh if this works it doesn't but it could uh if we keep that actually at oh no we'll need to bring it up one but if we take this through at 11 we should be able to come through yeah that's really cool did this break again it totally did i'm not even going to take the time to fix it this ride is popular enough the line will just everyone will come back you see how many people are in line there it's crazy oh gosh okay um but yeah if we take i'm thinking it'd be could be kind of cool to do the middle one kind of doing its own thing and then the other two on the sides not sticking to like a mirror image of each other but kind of doing similar things um so we went wide with this one and then i think we did two like that something oh and we've hit the point where we have no money i knew that would happen all right guys um I know we're in the middle of this project, but I actually think we're going to call it there for today. Um, I'm going to just sit and wait in this park for a while to get money before next episode. So we should have quite a bit more money when we come back next time. Hopefully enough to finish it. Um, we might actually just start the episode by completing our objective because I have a feeling I'm going to need to wait till probably at least October to get money to build this thing. Uh, so yeah, that, that's going to be a, a different ending for today than we normally do. Normally we have something to show as far as a completed coaster for our work. Today, not the case, but this is a really expensive project, so I hope you guys can understand. All right, guys, thank you very much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed. If you have any suggestions as to how I should finish this, that's actually something I can say now. I never leave a coaster unfinished, so you guys can actually... Give me some feedback as I go or how I should do the rest of it. I don't plan on demolishing anything I've done so far. So if you have a suggestion or a correction for something I've done, just don't, <laughs> please. Uh, but as far as a name or three names, technically, and how I should finish this, I would greatly appreciate it. Right now, I'm thinking of running this one around and underneath just like that one and then kind of coming up at different angles or different directions so this the brown one here would do a up or would go up and turn to its right bringing it this direction and then we can go up and over this and do some stuff then maybe loop around and kind of finish off the other one we could go through up and over this direction and maybe under this, and I don't know. I got ideas, but I don't have the money to do those ideas. So instead of just rambling, I'm gonna go. All right, guys, thank you very much for watching. Comments down below, please and thank you. I'll see you in the next one. And until then, as always, take care. <laughs>